All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the House of Commons APT, African Playhouse Theater. My name is Ike Steele. Eldi Dumola. Pascal Atuma. And Yosuji. And today's topic is, would you date someone you work with? Um, this topic is very, um, I mean, can go all directions, you know, a lot of people have different views about it, but... Can I fella, fellas, yeah, yeah, who wants to can jump, can on this one? jump on Please, this one? Go ahead. Yep. Um, I can't cuss on this show, so I will not cuss. But, uh, no. A word before no, no. Wherever my money comes from, absolutely not. Never, no, no, just no. What if you find someone that you love at work? And then one of us is not going to be working there. If I find somebody at my job that I fall in love with, I'm right. probably quitting that job. Oh, really? Absolutely. Unless, here's, here's, here's the situation. Mm -hmm. You can work in a hospital, right? A hospital is big. Right. You can work on a college campus. A college campus is humongous. Yeah. But if we're in close proximity, I am not doing it. Hmm. Does that make sense? This, this, the, the, the space between makes a difference. Would you agree? Okay. Well, 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 we'll delve into that, that in just a minute. So, Pascal, what's your view? Would you take someone you work with? All right, depends on what kind of business you guys are involved in. There are some businesses you need your partner to help you with, and as you guys can work together. I'll give an example. Usher does. You heard about that, but you get, got engaged. So there are situations you'll be in that you need your you need your partner or your girlfriend or your wife to play with you, to work with you. So there are some situations that you'll be in, you won't want them there. So it depends on the situation. So you say yes. I say yes. I work with uh, I work with my partner. I work with my wife. Someone that you no, you so will you date someone. Date someone that you yes, I okay, will. Okay, good. I will. Hey, hey. Um, a, a, a definitive no. <laughs> uh, is I, yeah, I just would not do that at all. I think that it's just it, it incredibly messy um, to work with somebody that to that you're being intimate with, that you're dating. You may not even be intimate, but I think that you, that you have an outside relationship that could be that could interfere with your work. And um, because of how volatile <clears throat> some some relationships can be, and and how our workplace is, I wouldn't ever want to put myself or her in that position where. Maybe an argument, or maybe we're bringing our energy from outside into work, and I don't want that to ever happen. So for me, a definitive hell no is what I would give this. <laughs> okay, can I say something? Can I have something? I haven't even said bro? mine. Okay, go ahead, bro. Go ahead, bro. I think um, I'm kind of leaning into no because um, it's um, it can get th very complicated because mm -hmm. your life could be a living hell if things go south mm -hmm. in that relationship if you're dating somebody um, that you work with. And the chances of you screwing up where you make your living is is just too, too high. Yeah. yeah, it's too high. The stakes are too high. I, I would rather not. What are you gonna say? When you mean you date someone to work with, I don't know what kind of date you're talking about. Is it like husband wife? It, it's like dating no, to, 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 to grow no, to something. Yeah, yeah, to to get whether you're working and girlfriend or your husband, I'm not gonna mention names. Gonna mention names. Most of my big boy friends that I know, they work with their wives. Like their businesses, they run with their wives. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, can, can I continue? Yeah. Can I they run with their wife. I know, as we're speaking right now, I can just come in my head of five of them that I know that they run their business with their wife and they're very, very successful. Of course. And they run their business. Own business. They own it. Totally right. different. They so own their own business. Whether, you, whether it's your business or it's not your business, work is work. Mm. Well, definitely. They're, 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 that's they're, that's they're, ideal. Well, but it doesn't yeah. always work out that way. No, some people, some I don't people. think it's even ideal. Oh, okay. it's, uh, no, no, I'm uh, saying it's uh, ideal uh, for him uh, to say uh, that. Uh, for uh, people uh, to work you know, harmoniously yeah. in, a, in a work environment. Yeah. My only thing is that there's a good chance that you can get into a work environment that's not your own, not the, not one that, that's run by somebody else mm -hmm. that can get messy. Mm -hmm. There's a chance that that can happen. No, there, I, I'm not saying that's a chance so, that it cannot happen. Well, what you're saying is, is well, ideal. Well, 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 well before, before, but Pascal, just to, to help you explain further. Mm -hmm. Now, those relationships, mm -hmm. did, did they meet each other before they started working together? I mean, did, 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 they, start, did they start living together now they have a business? Or how did that, did he have, do you okay, know? I'll give you an example. Uh, I know one of my friends, he's a movie director. Mm -hmm. So he was struggling in Canada. He was struggling uh, during his, trying to do his first feature film. Mm -hmm. And then he hired a couple of people to come and help him. But there was one particular girl that was going out of her way during that production, right, to help him succeed. 
Uh, he ended up finishing that production and the movie became successful. Mm -hmm. He went back to that chick and said, you know, you're the one that helped me most when I needed the most help in my life. If I'm in any way attracted to you, please. Can I say something? When their work, it wasn't in the context of a relationship. Yeah, yeah but that's what I'm trying. I'm coming to the other. So now, both of them run their own production company. And they work together. And they successful. own it. Though. They, and can I, can I keep, yeah. Yeah. Okay. You keep yeah. saying yeah. something? Yeah. I just need to say Go something. Yeah. So Meeting somebody who's going to help you build an empire for both of you is different from working at a job, meeting someone, and getting in a relationship at a job. So, for example, as I mentioned proximity, mm -hmm. it's totally different if you work in a hospital mm -hmm. and I work in the emergency department that's like 15 mm -hmm. miles away mm -hmm. or like, you know, maybe three miles away and mm -hmm. she works in IT and it's like, you know, we, get, we have enough space, mm -hmm. right? Because here's the one thing I'll say. I have, I'm a pretty charismatic guy, you know, I'm not... Carry what? Charisma. I have charisma. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm comfortable, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know, yeah, yeah. laughing and yeah, being yeah, social yeah, yeah. with yeah, yeah. women, mm -hmm. okay. right? If my girlfriend works or my wife works at a job, By the way, and my a lot, so you're saying you're flirtatious. I, I mean, mean I, I can make like a girl smile and laugh. Exactly, mm -hmm. right? Okay. Yeah. What would be seen as being flirtatious, but you may not exactly. be flirtatious right. Exactly. I might crack a joke, mm -hmm. and I might crack a joke to girls too much. Right. And mm -hmm. how would that look in my girlfriend or wife's eyes? I see. Mm -hmm. Doesn't that make things complex? It depends on the trust level. All right. Thank you very much. No, even now, I was going to say, after you speak, then I'll go. No, it depends on the person. It depends on the situation. I think that it, it, one thing that I, I keep pointing to is when you own your own business, not that it can't be dicey, not that it can't be, you can't have arguments or things can't fall apart. Yeah, if, but, it's, if you want to, it's a it different, can't fall apart. It can yeah. fall apart. Yeah. I just think that the, the the way it's set up and the understanding that's already that's already there makes it a lot more difficult at times to break apart because if you're walking into a situation where this is your role, this is my role, this is how we organize and do business, unless it's some sort of like ridiculous argument or some sort of outside thing that happens, that's understand we we this is our business. When as, when I guess the difference would be going into a work environment where you don't own the business mm -hmm. and you're working under somebody in a, in a work environment where you have your own, you know, you have your own responsibilities. Mm -hmm. They got their own responsibilities. And and there's a bill due at home, but it's still at work. You say, well, exactly. You say, exactly. <laughs> it's, 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 you know, you say, so, okay. It's a right. different. Okay. Yeah. Like they say, there's always an exception to the rule, mm -hmm. to every rule. There's right. always an exception. Like Pascal, I think what you cited is um, a great exception to the rule yes. because most times to tell you the truth relationships are hard in itself alone mm -hmm. talk less of now bringing the work environment into it you know there's mm -hmm. somebody you're dating and you're seeing them 24-7 you know like, at exactly work like and every and single time you know and and like you said earlier I think you will be more too conscious of, of your every move when you, you when someone you date with also works it's with you. Really so you know, uh, to the point where it's not going to be on the screw. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. Okay. One thing that you got to realize about the work environment is your work friends become your friends because you're with them all the time. time yeah. And here's another thing that you got to keep in mind. A guy would vent to his co-workers about what's going on at home. A lady will vent to her co-workers about what's going on at home. Yeah. You're both there, and now your co-workers know everything that it's, they should it, not it's know. It's almost impossible for the <laughs> entire, like, whatever department not to know about your business. Exactly. It's Which almost is impossible. completely okay. unknown. Okay, okay, but you see, uh, depending on what kind of uh, understanding you guys have, I think you can get somebody, and you guys think, uh, it's not yeah. everybody. Yeah, yeah you guys will get an agreement that whatever we do at home. I don't know about the agreements. The agreements. I don't know about, the agreement. the yeah. agreement. Yeah. I don't know about that. Yeah. But if, if you guys have, if your relationship is built upon, like you guys are the type of people that do not step outside, then that's what you're lucky. You guys are oh, cool. But some people don't. How step. realistic is that, bro? I don't. It's not very realistic, bro. As I just mentioned, it's not very realistic. Vent to your coworkers. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, okay, okay. Okay. not everybody anyway, does that. Yeah. But, uh, I, uh, mm -hmm. you, you, anyway, it might be difficult. If you guys don't own the business, mm -hmm. but most of the businesses that are you will see either like grocery stores, restaurants, right, mm -hmm. uh, are owned by partners. Are owned by partners. Of course. Are owned by families. Like of course. Almost every family I remember walk that mm -hmm. place. Is mm -hmm. what I'm saying. So in that kind of situation, you you grow to learn, right, how to keep things 
this. And, and that's, but that's well, well, that's, well let's, let's keep things in perspective mm-hmm. there. There's a difference between if you guys are already together and you start a business, mm-hmm. then when you guys are just dating and you now before you start a business, when you when you're dating and you meet at a workplace, mm-hmm. it's a different dynamics. Totally than, okay, so, you know, well, you, than you, a, you, a family yeah, business. Oh yeah, but now nice. you wanna tell me because you work with a girl and you really really like this girl. Because of that, you won't date this girl. Okay, let me ask you this. Your job. Okay, is it easy I'm, to quit a job and get It's not easy to quit a job, but it's easy to make a smart decision. Okay, the smart decision. Make smart, let me the ask smart you this. That would affect okay, your okay, let me ask you this. Let me ask this question. Since you mentioned business owners, mm-hmm. you own a business mm-hmm. with your best friend, mm-hmm. right? He starts dating a girl at your house. No, I own my business with my brother. Okay, you own your business. It's just giving me a sense. Come on, bro. Mm-hmm. You own a business with your co with with, with a friend, right? Mm-hmm. Your best friend. He's a guy. He starts dating one of your female employees. Right, your female employee is messing up mm-hmm. on the job. Right, let's say it's a restaurant, she's not mm-hmm. serving, she's coming in late. You have to discipline your female employee. Mm-hmm. How does that affect your relationship with your best friend who's your co owner? Um, uh, business is business, bro. Business is business. Hmm. When it comes to business, I can know me now, you mm-hmm. know how we do it. When it comes to business, there's no brother, sister. Well, that's I guess that's why Period. you should agree that it's, it's best not to be exactly. people you no, work with. No, no, exactly. Our relationship, our relationship, you know? our relationship as a friend, mm-hmm. our relationship as a brother, our relationship as a boyfriend and girlfriend don't have nothing to do with business. When it's business, I give you an example. My brother Oscar. He's not mess- he's not mm-hmm. getting the point I'm making. No, yeah, I'm getting the point. Agree with us. No, 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 no. I'm you not agreeing agree with us. Agree you with are. You. No, the point you're saying. How would I handle it? Yeah. Because, so it wouldn't affect my relationship with my co-owner, right? Mm-hmm. I will handle this strictly the way business is supposed to be handled. Right, but so I guess you agree with the point that it's best not to even go there. No, it doesn't the matter. Place. It's something to me. If I'm <laughs> if, if it's my in for me. He can date it. it. But if you mess up, you will just set that uh, with my, my if business. If it doesn't, yes, we will treat okay. it like that. I give you an example. In our business, mm-hmm. when, when we've been into our production, when I'm working with my brother, Oscar, when we had it, you know what I call him? Mr. Oscar. Mm-hmm. But once we are not working, now my brother, mm-hmm. his name is Bob, mm-hmm. GB, do you understand what I'm mm-hmm. saying? So, Mr. Okay. Oscar, when we are doing our business, mm-hmm. but when we come inside the house, bros, I just think uh, dating somebody you work with is similar to dating somebody that's your neighbor. It's best not to do it. Mm-hmm. It's best not to do it. No, no, there is no best your neighbor is very Because, that one, you know what? That one, I will put them in this, I'll put them in the class. I will not do that uh, one. I will not okay, do that. You know what? I think neighbor. we should go into that as a next topic after Absolutely. this one. Let's talk about dating. Actually, neighbors. I think the next topic should be what is it best if a husband and wife have separate homes? <laughs> well, no, no, what? that's a totally different what? place. Let's talk about what? this dating uh, your neighbor. That's a good Anyway, that's anyway, anyway no, that's do you guys want to conclude this one? That's not open online. Do you guys want to conclude or want to talk more? That's a, do you, uh, you have anything to say? I have something to say. say. Okay, go ahead. Don't go ahead. Don't go ahead. No, no, no. It's not enough. Wait, what are you saying? Go ahead. Go ahead. No, no. All I'm saying is, okay, look. A good example was, um, you mentioned, um, Usher. Mm-hmm. Usher, yes. Usher, Usher dating, you know, dating his manager. manager. Yeah, now, but, now they're engaged. Or people like J Lo dating her, her dancer. Mm. But I just that's think messy, man. It's, it's too messy. Especially in the entertainment. Yeah. It, it, Usher is okay, a sex. Okay, let me finish. Let me finish. It's just like okay, look. Okay. Probably, uh, I have a business. Okay, I I do um, interviews. So I go to rep- mm-hmm. celebrity red carpet. Mm-hmm. I've gone with somebody that I'm. Kind of have interest in mm-hmm. to, to work as a partner mm-hmm. and i'm doing my interviews and because i'm flirting you have to flirt in mm-hmm. this kind of business when you do interviews oh my god her nigerian? body no she wasn't nigerian her body the way her language even the work she was supposed to mm-hmm. do was not done she's turning up the light hey, <laughs> shut down the camera was Ooh, shooting no shooting. <laughs> <laughs> so, so i i learned a key lesson don't even try no. next time don't e- no. either you know just take you know, somebody that will do the job and you know well i was, I was going to say it's, uh-huh. it's business it's work it's something that needs to be you, you, you're a, you're under somebody you're trying to make money for yourself it's mm-hmm. something serious you're trying to be professional so when you're when you're that's and that's and if you go back to i know i'm gonna i'm kind of taking a far but you go back to the industrial revolution mm-hmm. at a time before the industrial revolution 
you know, they, they had women in the workplace with men, and it wasn't working out because it was, it was hot, it was sweaty, and then people get horny, and they be doing all, all day. That's a whole different topic. That's a whole different topic, but I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just you guys saying, said horny? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm just saying that, and, and, that, and then oh, yeah. that's when they, they that's kind of began that whole idea wow. of women not working in the same. In the same is that time. really why? Yeah, that's a part of it because oh. they'll all work. They'll like they'll be mining and do all kinds of crazy work, and there'll be women, and it's you know, get high, get take clothes and shit, and you know, right. just like taking these shoes, you know, yeah, 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 you know what I'm saying? So I think it has to remain uh, professional. It has to remain professional. And right. If you're over there looking at yeah, she wants to touch this thing. It's, it's, I will start a business with my. Wife or girlfriend? Yeah, completely. It, right. Yeah, so that's an idea. Mm -hmm. But yeah, will I work in the same job? And my cubicle is dead. Ah. I don't know about okay, that. Okay, for me. No. Okay, this is conclusion, right? Conclusion. Okay, conclusion. Conclusion. For me, I will walk. I will date someone I walk with. But I will do business with someone I walk. With, or I'm dating. How? It depends on how your professional level. Because you see, I give you an example. When uh, we're doing movies and I'm directing, mm -hmm. I'm casting a movie. I don't care, it doesn't matter who you are. I'm, I, I'm looking for that character. I'm going right? to bring one specific point. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. So, okay. It I'll, okay. It, it doesn't matter who you are, I'm looking for that particular character, right? Even if I've, I've had some girls who I try to date, but because I don't want to cast them in the movie, they, move, they go their way. Mm -hmm. And I don't care. You know why? Because if, if my job, right, you cannot separate private business from business, mm -hmm. right? Then, then you, that's, some, that's a problem. Let me ask you a simple question. Mm -hmm. When was the last time you worked in an office? Mm -hmm. When was the last time I worked in an office? Uh, exactly. Ross, <laughs> Ross, hold on, hold on. I think on. I'm, I'm, the, I'm uh, thinking, I'm thinking. Uh, right. 19. I've, I've always owned my own business. I've gone for business. So you've never worked in an office? office. I've never worked for... Okay, that kind of So it's a different mentality. Yeah. So totally different. Okay, yeah. conclude this. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? I have no thing to real, man. I feel you. Yeah, I've gone from business to business. Don't business worry. Business, you okay. know? That's why I say that. Yeah. Uh -huh. I think you can work with your with your spouse, your mate, whoever. I think you can do... I think you can do... I think it's, it depends on what you're doing, the content. Oh, I work in an office. Oh. I used to be a personal player. <laughs> I bet because you don't even mind this guy. Yeah, I used to be a personal player. Go, go, please, please, please. <laughs> When I first came to LA, I was a personal trainer. It's not an office. Because what I'm saying, hey, please. Uh -huh. yeah. No, you can work with you can work with your spouse. You can work with the person depending on an understanding of what's going on. Or what? It's this guy. Let him finish. Maybe he's yeah. coming somewhere. I'm coming. You he's can. going somewhere. But, Lie. No, you Lie. can. No, you can. I think you can work with yourself, but I think that it depends on the context of the situation. If you guys own your own business and you guys are having an understanding, you can do that. But if you're working in. Uh, if you're working in a where you, have, you guys have cubicles working in an office and stuff like that, I think it's very, very risky for a lot of reasons. I think that's why I think I think it depends on the context of what you're doing, you know. And not to say that even if you owned your own business and you guys had your own thing that it couldn't fall apart because marriages fall apart all the time, you know. So it's that's it's, a whole other time. That's a that's a whole other thing. If marriage fall apart because the business business, business business exactly. Hmm. Go ahead. Mm. That's a big one. All right. You conclude. <laughs> My bad. I don't need many words. No. If I'm working in an office, no, it's not happening. I will get you the best job in the other company across the street, <laughs> across the city. <laughs> it ain't happening in my people. Nah, bruh. I'm sorry. I love you. So you have that kind of power. You just get that. If not be, if it's not you, it is me. So we are not yeah, yeah, saying that. Really not trust yourself. No, it's not about trust. It's yeah. about where my money comes from. I don't want anything outside of where my money is. All right, let me conclude. When we walk into that office, you're talking about girlfriend. Video. All right. Would you date somebody you 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 work with? I I I'll say it's best not to. It's mm -hmm. too messy. It's too close to home. You don't want to um where you eat. You don't want to you know. Exactly. Um, I, it's best not to do it. Definitely, if you guys become a a, a couple or whatever an item, you can start a business. You can buy a company. <laughs> it's totally a different ballgame yeah. at that point. Yeah. So that's my conclusion. Um, well, so my conclusion, I will date anybody I, I work with, I will work with But if you have a really nice job, I will get you. If you have a really nice job, let's talk.